It is truly a great honor for, for APT to win the 2017 Enlightenment Award within the category Enabling Technologies. And it's actually a huge accomplishment for the whole APT team who is constantly working uh, to produce, um, um, to help our customers to produce lighter safer and more energy efficient products. The reaction was really positive from, from the complete APT team because they, they knew, they, they put so much effort into the development of, uh, of this um, uh, multi-purpose production line. Uh, so everyone was working hard, doing a lot of overtime. And uh, so this is really uh, rewarding for, for everyone in, in APT. APT develops and supplies um, sheet metal forming companies globally with uh, complete uh, cost efficient production solutions as well as uh, standalone presses, furnaces, toolings and uh, linear automation products. There is a shift in, uh, in the applications of materials and there is a, a, strong, a strong lead towards high strength materials and as you mentioned it is uh, a lead in towards even further increase in press on steel components but now we have seen uh, good examples for example Ford did uh, a tremendous job on the Ford F-150, Jaguar Land Rover very well known as uh, aluminum intensive um, OEM. Uh, this has shown us that uh, even in aluminum uh, car bodies there's a need for, for implementing high strength components even, even, even more and uh, which allows them to enhance their uh, light weighting possibilities. Regulations for passenger safety are setting really high demands uh, on, the, on the car body stiffness and uh, therefore the usage of high strength material is uh, mandatory. Either it is high strength steel or high strength aluminum in, in our case. To be able to fulfill these uh, passenger requirements uh, by using high strength material you need advanced processes and this is our specialties. This is where we have our know-how. We're coming from uh, press hardening of steel where we're using the, the hot forming process and now we have the possibility to show also our, our core competencies. The development task itself was solved by a holistic approach. We have uh, we, we were thinking about uh, the material itself, the high strength aluminium uh, needs to have an adequate process to be able to form a complex design and that's why we said we have to involve uh, research or the academia, we have to involve our suppliers, we have to involve our customers in order also to fulfill their needs. As I mentioned before, our core technology comes from, from press hardening of steel and now being able to use hot forming of, of high strength aluminum allows our customers to produce uh, safety relevant lightweight components with a complex design out of high strength material where, where they actually have the possibility to down gauge um, the, the components without compromising on the safety and functional requirements. Virtual development and simulation is one, one key part of APNT's development, not only within our tooling technology where we use FE simulation or CFD simulation in order to design and, um, and, and um, create our forming tools for, for press hardening of steel uh, and also now for, for hot forming of aluminum. Uh, but also virtual development is playing a key role within APNT for developing our production solutions. So we, before we start producing our actual machines which are assembled in these complex production solutions, we start in the virtual development. So we start with CAD and also run the, the virtual development, how those lines fit together. We actually have them running virtually, so to say, if we have any problems in the process flow, how the machines interact. So it's actually playing a key role within APNT and uh, everything has to be virtually development before we start actually producing actual machines. We talk about resistance from automotive industry. Yes, it's, uh, it's definitely not easy if you have face-by-face uh, -face discussions with, uh, with OEMs because they think the raw material is much more expensive than uh, when you compare it to steel or uh, low-grade aluminium grades. So that's why it's, it's, we, we took it as one of our tasks to uh, explain the, the holistic development approach and uh, don't think so much about the raw material costs. It is all about uh, part integration, function integration to, to create much more out of a high strength aluminium grade component than you can do with a low strength aluminium grade component which then at the end saves you a lot of money on the specific component and on top of that you have the lightweighting advantages. You can actually create components with even more complex design out of a high strength uh, material 
um, then uh, you would be able to, to do with uh, low grade materials. So I would recommend uh, each and everyone who has, a who has done a lot of development in, in this type of category to apply for this, uh, for this process. And the, the recognition within the, within the companies is then really, uh, it's, it's quite high because you, you can, everyone sees, hey, this is what we have done. We have created something really new and we have the possibility to apply for such a big, uh, highly recognized award. Thank you very much to Altea and, and the Center for Automotive Research for hosting this type of, um, this type of award. And uh, also a big thank to the judges who actually were voting for APNT. Thank you very much.